There are many codes in the Swarm Simulator. I think there's something like 30 right now, and they all give crazy things. Ranging from just a bit of honey to literal overpowered boosts that will make you trillions. That's right, guys. There is a lot of OP codes, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys all of them. That way, you guys can redeem them and get all of the free OP rewards. And yeah, definitely be sure to watch the entire video because the codes just get more overpowered as the video goes on. Also, I drove for like 12 hours yesterday, and I'm absolutely miserable right now. But I'm still editing this video for you guys, so if you could take just a few seconds and sub, it would really mean a lot. Alright, so here we are. We're actually going to stay on my main account for a bit. I'll switch later in the video. But starting off, the first code is WAX. Now, it's a pretty simple code. I've already redeemed it, but it basically just gives you 5 tickets and 5,000 honey. Alright, now next up is ROOF. Hopefully, you know how to spell ROOF. If you don't, it's actually right here. This is the hint to the code. It's right here on the red HQ, and it just gives you 5 tickets. Pretty good. After that, though, moving on to the very next code, it's NECTAR. I guess kind of a hint towards the NECTARs that were released last Beesmas. Wait, I haven't redeemed redeem that code? Oh my gosh, guys, what's wrong with me? I have the gummy baller, a full level 20 hive, but I haven't redeemed the nectar code? Well, no matter. Now you guys can see it gives you 5,000 honey, and after that is crawlers, spelled like this, redeem it. And basically what that does is it gives you five tickets, and there's actually a hint to this code in the main game. It's in King Beetle's Lair. Right here it says song name, and the song that plays in King Beetle's Lair is called Crawlers, so there's your little hint. Now, after that is Connoisseur. Now, this one's a little tricky to spell, but it's spelled C-O-N-N-O-I-S-S-E-U-R. Connoisseur, and as you can see, I've already redeemed it, but in one of Black Bear's quests, he actually refers to himself as a honey connoisseur, sort of hinting towards the fact that this code actually exists. Make sure you use this code, it grants you five tickets, and after that is the code COG. There's three letters, but it gives you five tickets, and there's actually another hint to this one as well. It's this green COG up here, which actually now has the free robo pass on top of it, so there you go. After that's the code Buzz, pretty simple, just buzz. Gives you 5,000 honey, and after that is the code Bop Master. Panda Bear actually reveals this code in his dialogue, and it appears I haven't actually redeemed that code either. But there you go, Bop Master, five tickets. And next up is, now this code's kinda weird, it's a number, but the code is 38217. I know, it's a kind of random sequence of numbers, it gives you five tickets. And there actually used to be a hint to this code, the capacity on, on its backpack right here used to say 38217, now it does not, but the code still does exist, so make sure to get those five free tickets. All right, now here is where we actually start to get into the good codes. Now, the code is Wink. There you go, redeem that code right there, and what it'll actually give you is a Black Bear more and a times seven Dandelion boost. Make sure you're gonna use this code right before you boot. In case you are wondering how a times seven boost is even possible, it's actually not, but the code used to give you a times seven boost, now it only gives you a times four boost, and the little hint is the B winking at the end of this tunnel, and it also gives you some tickets and some money. Now, after that is the code Club Bean. Club Bean. There you go. Redeem it, and like stated in the code, you do have to be in the Bee Swarm Club, aka the group, in order to redeem this code, but basically it just gives you a free magic bean and a little pineapple patch boost. After that is the secret profile code. Not so secret anymore, as you can see, but it gives you some pretty random stuff. A shock to be jelly, an enzymes buff, ant pass, and the oil and glue buffs. So make sure that when you use secret profile code, you are once again ready to do a boost. So that way you don't waste this free oil and glue buff. After that is gumdrops for science. I think you also do have to be in the club to redeem this code. And basically it'll just give you 15 free gumdrops. Pretty useful if you're saving up for the gummy bee. Because when making one cost 2,500 gumdrops, every single gumdrop counts. So hopefully this helps with your gummy bee grind. And after that is the code sure. Oh, and it seems once again I have not used it. Well, there goes a wasted conversion boost, but as you can see, there are the rewards. A conversion boost for 30 minutes, which can also be granted by turning in a honey bee quest, and then a times three dandelion field buff. Oh, and like 2,500 honey. After that's another pretty big one, it's club converters. Once again, you must be in the club to redeem this one, and it basically just gives you 10 free micros. So if you use the other codes in this video and you don't have any micros to boost, well, use this code and then you will. And on the topic of boosting, up is the next 
max code, which is Marshmallow, which rewards you with a Marshmallow B. These are pretty rare, seeing as you can't really get them in the main game anymore, so this is definitely a really nice code. So don't waste this Marshmallow B, and it also gives you a one-hour conversion boost. All right, now I'm gonna hop on to a different account because these codes are gonna start getting a little more overpowered, and I want you guys to see the rewards. All right, everybody, we're now on a new account to redeem the rest of these codes. So let's start things off with a bang. The code is 500 mil. I actually have already redeemed it on this account, but it gives you field dice, wealth clock times five, a conversion boost, a stump field boost, a, just a lot of free stuff. After that is the code Teespring. Pretty sweet code, just gives you another rare marshmallow B, a bamboo field boost times three, and some bamboo field wins. And next is the code Cubly. I guess maybe a reference to the Cub Buddies when they came out, but it gives you 10 micro converters, a capacity code buff, so actually save this code if you want, because capacity code buffs are really overpowered if you're a blue hive. After that is the code band. It's kind of strange code, but yeah, that's the code. It gives you a spider code buff. This code is actually really overpowered. Save this code if you're a white hive because code buffs can only be obtained using codes. And also it gives you a random stubborn bee jelly. The buff is what's really important. All right, guys, next up, we have a really big code coming up. It's 1M likes to celebrate the game, getting 1 million likes. I have already redeemed it, but here are all the rewards on screen right now. A super smoothie buff, unlimited gumdrops for an hour, mother bear morph, a blue boost, red boost, white boost, baby love melody, a mountain clover, blue flower, sunfield mushroom, spider, strawberry, bamboo, pineapple boost, capacity boost, wealth clock, a ticket treat, bitterberry, sunflower seed, strawberry, blueberry, pineapple, moon charm, cloud vial, and pass, field dice, micro converter, coconut stinger, gumdrop, and one honey. Gosh, that was a mouthful to say. If that doesn't earn a sub, I don't know what does. But yes, a very overpowered code. On to the next one. After that is the code plush Friday. Pretty nice code. Gives you another rare marshmallow bee and then a neon berry and free micro converter. And now next up, the codes are gonna get really overpowered. Starting off with the code 10M members, which is the 10 million members in the bee swarm simulator group. Here are all of the rewards on screen. 10 neon berries, strawberries, blueberries, pineapples, sunflower seeds, gumdrops, moon charms, haste, focus, red boost, blue boost, white boost, and then along with a black bear morph, and then a pineapple and pepper boost and a few other things. Now, next up is the code Walmart Toys. And there you go. This is actually another really good code. It gives you a pineapple boost. Actually, a lot of random pineapple boosts. It activates a super smoothie and gives you some nice free wealth clock. So if you're going to use this code, make sure that you are indeed ready for a very overpowered pineapple boost. Next up is Thunksias, or Thanksias, depending on how you want to pronounce it. Thanksias Toy Box. And yes, this is a reference to the YouTuber Thanksias. See if you guys watch him. He's pretty cool, but it gives you a marshmallow bee pumpkin boosts and a bunch of other random stuff. So if you're a white hive, then this is definitely a very overpowered code for you. Because look at all these boosts right here. Now, after that is the code Darzeth Doodads. There you go, Darzeth Doodads. And yes, that is a reference to the YouTuber. Gives you a clover and coconut boost, along with a red balloon, a marshmallow bee, and some other random little things that can be pretty useful. Now, after that is a very, very very overpowered code guys get ready to use this code and man is this overpowered but the code is five years and oh man look at that now you might be wondering why this is so overpowered well for starters it gives you five marshmallow bees that's so many and then it gives you a super smoothie buff wealth clock times five and by far the most overpowered part of this code the honey day event probably one of the craziest things this gives you times two honey and convert rate for 48 hours make sure that you are ready to do a very overpowered boost with this code. Also gives you like five micro converters, five tickets, five neon berries, and five smooth dice, but that's not really overpowered. After that is the code week extension. I think this code actually expired, but I mean, you might as well try it. But if it does work, it does give you a free marshmallow bee and a spider field boost and some other things. Now we have one final code left. It is a very, very overpowered code. So if you're gonna use the five years code, use this one along with it and make sure that you have your coconut crab defeated for this code because yes, it gives you a coconut boost. The code is Demi Decade as a celebration for Bee Swarm Simulator being out for five full years. It's a really big celebratory code. And please like and subscribe once again because I took hours out of my vacation to make this for you guys. And I will definitely make videos when more codes will come out. So subscribe so you don't miss that. Thank you so much for watching guys. I'm your favorite White Hive and I will see you guys later.